The Plastics Pathway is a route along the zoo path where we highlight different elements about the issue of plastic. It's a big path, it's a lot to follow, <laughs> and there's a lot of information, so there's something new to help visitors with that. Definitely. So the path starts right at the front entrance, even before the people actually enter the Toronto Zoo. It runs through our core woods, right through to the tundra trek and around the Eurasia. So that can take them a little while. We now have a new app available called the Plastics Pathway app. And you can download it for free on your iPhone or your Android phone. And it will help you wayfind from one element to the other. It will provide more detail than you can find on our signs. Once you get to an element, you can then source into the industry or on the web new information regarding the issue of plastic. What is the link between the zoo and plastic? Like why would the zoo uh, promote all this information? We feel it's important that Toronto Zoo is part of this message because plastics have had a negative impact on the environment. We're polluting aquatic ecosystems and that is getting up into the food chain and is polluting different species as you go up, including some of the food that we're ingesting as people. The app is available for download online or by accessing the QR codes along the plastics pathway. At the Toronto Zoo, Audra Brown, City News.